Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, I posted a video on my butternut squash and my spaghetti squash harvest. And this is the same day we're going to keep it moving and we're going to pick out the Ruby Perfection cabbage. I picked out the Copenhagen green cabbage already, but I can show you that. So I thought I would bring you along to harvest the cabbage. So hopefully... <clears throat> these will cut and we shall see these could have been harvested a little bit sooner but that's okay you know I know people are like oh you can just leave the root in there it's been in here for some time and I already struggled Getting the Copenhagen out. So, let's see. We are going to harvest cabbage. Sheesh. This one took more of a beating because it was closer. The reason why I ripped out my butternut squash and spaghetti squash already is because of the factor there was like a ton of squash bugs on um, you know, the vine and it looked terrible. So I'm going to peel this out here. This one was the one that was closest to it. So I'm going to check it over see if I see anything will be a smaller head, I'm sure. Okay. Cabbage number one. Let's just put that in there. All right, so I have to harvest potatoes. Busy, busy, busy. rain all weekend and yesterday so there we go cabbage number two there we go beautiful multiple times and then it's just time spent looking. Voila. There we go. Look at that beauty. Perfect. Let's keep going. leaves didn't look like this you could make something out of it like a sort of like a collard green a lot of people eat their cabbage leaves but I'm not going to I am going to be fermenting some green some red I'll bring you along for that process and yeah fresh eating Get closer. There you go. Let's keep going. I don't even know if these are seeing all this. Let me raise you up a hair. <laughs> okay. We're almost done harvesting. The Ruby Red Perfection is the name of this one. 
I'm expecting one to be a little bit smaller because I didn't realize they were on top of each other. Oh, it scared me. I just had a cabbage roll off. I think it was a wild animal. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. I love the color. And then this one's actually tilted. Oops. <laughs> Fell right out. Taking the outer leaves off. Better to keep the mess outside is the way I look at it. There we go. So I think I did, let me see, one. I think of this particular one and I absolutely love it I'm quite pleased with it it is gorgeous so I'm not really sure if you can see me but I've been a busy bee so this is the ruby red perfection and on this half it was the um, sugar baby pumpkins uh, cucumbers that could completely burn to a crisp. It's been so hot here. The only reason why I have a shirt on right now is because of the mosquitoes. So this half of the bed I harvested today. Butternut squash and um, spaghetti squash. And I mended the soil with perlite, bone meal, um, like a Job's. What is this other one that I used? Um... Just some lime because it's beets so yeah I did that harvesting video and now I'm coming at you with the cabbage video so my garden has been very prolific it's a lot of work but I love it in all retrospect I love it so there you have it I hope you were able to see look at that how beautiful that is came out great definitely pleased with it and I planted this in spring so there is the red cabbage uh, ruby perfection harvest I hope you enjoyed it um, I can try to show you I just have it in a little tray like this all on top of each other there we go <laughs> cabbage harvest so I'm thrilled to have it done uh, love you guys and like, subscribe, share, and I will see you on the next video. God bless.